<laughs> I'm, I'm so glad to be here. For those of you all who do not know me, my name is Rob Richardson. I'm a resident of Baltimore, been here all my life, born in John Hopkins Hospital. Let me tell you about my home. My home is located on about two acres of land with multiple bedrooms, multiple bathrooms, swimming pool, tennis court. I love my apartment. It is nice, y'all. I'm telling y'all that right now. <laughs> Yes, but uh, let me, I, I have two kids, and the thing about kids, kids, they, they like um, amusement parks. I took my kids to Hershey Park uh, this summer, and the uh, thing of it is with the, with the amusement park, they like these high rides, all of that stuff. Now, the older you get, the more you like your feet on solid ground. And so um, uh, these, these kids, they love these high rides and roller coasters, all of that, and uh, I'm like, hey, I, I don't like that. I'm not gonna ride that because I'm afraid of heights. Any of you all afraid of heights? I'm afraid of heights, man. Park heights, Liberty Heights. Uh... <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> and it's crazy. It's about to snow now in, in Baltimore. People get crazy when it snows. Don't they get crazy? Oh, yeah. It's just crazy. I mean, people, I'm, matter of fact, uh, this last big snowstorm that hit the East Coast, uh, I'm pulling up in my neighborhood and this. Uh, you know, people put chairs out. You can get free furniture, too, when it snows. Did y'all know that? <laughs> this guy put these chairs out there, right? This chair in, in, in front of his home. And so I, I pull the chair out. It's the only spot in the neighborhood. I pull the chair out, put it in the snow. I pull in the parking spot. He come running out the house. Hey, you can't park there. I'm like, sir, it's no other place to park. Otherwise, I'll be in the street. My wife is about to come home. You can't park there. I said, sir, I can't leave my car in the street, so I'm not moving. I'm calling the police on you. As soon as he did that, man, I backed right out of his driveway. I'm telling you that right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy out there. <clears throat> what is everybody talking about? Everybody's talking about football. That's what they're talking about. Talking about the Broncos. And uh, you got... Uh, Vaughn Miller, you got uh, Peyton Manning, Demarcus Ware, and do not forget the most famous Bronco of all, the one OJ was riding down the road in. Y'all remember that one, don't you? <laughs> you know what I'm glad about? I'm glad that it was actually Super Bowl 50. That's easy for me, because those Roman numerals were messing me up. <laughs> I'm sure people have me, what, what Super Bowl is it? I don't know, I think it's extra, extra large. I don't have a clue <laughs> as to what it is. <laughs> but uh, a lot of stuff is going on here in the city of Baltimore, a lot of good stuff and uh, some bad stuff. And, and one of the things, I, you know, this is a great show and I, I commend the host and all of the people who participate in this great show in this great city of Baltimore. But the thing of it is, uh, one of the things I think we need to do with the youth, uh, a lot of them ride these motorcycles. I say, I personally say, build them motorcycle parks. That's what I say, because they're gonna ride those motorcycles anyway. You know what I mean? So give them something, a legal outlet. You think about this, they can take a dolphin from the Atlantic Ocean, bring them to the aquarium, train them, feed them, people will come to see that thing go, why can't these guys, man, they're jumping, riding these motorcycles, doing all kind of stuff. They're just doing it in a legal way. Give them a legal outlet. Let them do something positive. And, and what you can also do is pay them. That way you'll get them off the corners as well. So you're killing a whole bunch of birds in one stone. But uh, some of these guys, man, it's crazy. You know, sometimes you can be driving down the road and they're pulling wheelies. So they got the the, the, eight, uh, the all terrain vehicles. They got motorcycles. Like, yeah, yeah. They go down to yeah, yeah, yeah. They ride these things. And I was in standstill traffic one day. Standstill, ain't moving nowhere. And uh, this kid, he had to be about 12, maybe 13 years old, something like that. This kid, he didn't have it all there. He's doing a wheelie in the middle, weaving in and out of cars. Now, he didn't have a motorcycle. He was just... Like, Craziness. And before I get out of here, I think one of the things that uh, the older people ought to do, especially the older guys, be mentors to the younger guys. Don't try to be the younger guys and you 60 years old. <laughs> you got guys out here.
here 60 years old walking around with cruddies. <laughs> now y'all know the haircuts, the cruddies, right? That the young people wear. Walking around with a cruddy 60 years old. Now the problem is they ball on top, the cruddy is all around the side. <laughs> Hey, look, my name is Rob Richardson. Thank you so much, Baltimore, for your time. I appreciate it.